Hello, good day once again everyone and welcome back to the channel. This is once again the Daily Dose and for today we are going to take a look at uh, some new release from Hot Wheels, Matchbox and a lot more. So if you like diecast cars and if you want to get updates on what's the latest uh, in the diecast world, please subscribe to the channel. Again, that's the Daily Dose. Subscribe. Click the bell icon so you won't miss our daily uploads and also smash that like button. Those three will really help the channel out with the YouTube algorithm and all. So we'll start today's episode with uh, more updates from uh, the latest 2022 Matchbox release. Some main lines, some from their retro series. So here are the cars in here. So we finally get a uh, Lexus LS400 for this and this is yeah really really cool love this in white and uh, yeah two-tone car top part is almost like an off-white uh, color and the bottom part is of course gray love the steelies on this really simple looking but yeah fantastic detailed car as you see so again headlights detailed and i do believe taillights are also detailed for this one so the other cars we have uh, featured already and talked about, we'll just uh, talk about some more of the cars in here. And yeah, look at that. Yeah, this one we talk about this also in our previous video. Really cool looking one right here. And here is the El Camino. Looks good. Uh, it says the widow. It got the spider webs right here going and big spider on the hood really cool looking decos not really quite sure uh, what's the meaning of the deco right here or yeah, is there something uh, for this car with the decos but uh, art wise or look wise it is fantastic love the red tint also on the uh, windows right here looks fantastic the tires kind of look like major tires but other than that terrific looking car right here again 2022 updates from matchbox and this is a really awesome looking camaro man this is awesome again look at that simple but beautiful cars man matchbox always uh, does a fantastic job with their cars from main lines to their uh, premium ones even their moving parts sets this is awesome man look at that beautiful camaro and uh yeah some more cars in here as you see volkswagen beetle you got a mini yeah we talk about these cars but yeah i've got to ask you a question which is your favorite car in uh this video for yeah the matchbox uh, update leave a comment down below awesome looking cars man awesome looking cars moving on really exciting uh, news for, for hot wheels collectors especially for jdm fanboys out there this will probably be uh my prediction it will be one of 2020's most sought after super treasure hunt yeah the jdm of course and yeah this is the honda civic ek9 in gold again super beautiful and it got the gold paint on it this is super fine again look at that the wheels still don't know if this is real or if this is the one that they will put on for this casting but other than that look at that gold paint job looks good got a similar interior color as their main lines for this again tail lights headlights detailed got the uh honda logo also right there really really cool and credits by the way to putty punji uh t hunted blog b holland diecast uh thanks for the share of this awesome uh honda civic ek9 from hot wheels man who's excited for this super treasure hunt leave a comment down below if the main line was really hard to find yeah the white one this would be <laughs> exponentially harder to find yeah look at that that is fantastic same color 
same paint as their uh, previous Acura NSX Super Treasure Hunt way back then. From M2 Machines, here is an Auto Lift 2 pack uh, right here, new one coming soon. This is so cool. Force 2 packs, it has two cars in it. So we got the Volkswagen 2 pack, Volkswagen Beetle Deluxe USA model right here. Looks awesome. Love the dark green uh, on top right here. That looks really good. And of course, this down below the orange uh, Beetle still looks fantastic. I like the top one, it looks more classic. Moving on, a couple of Dodge Chargers right here in purple. And yeah, this is fantastic. Again, love this one better down below. That is, man, great looking cars, man, from M2 Machines. 66 Ford Bronco right here. Look at that. I like the top one a lot better. Yeah, but again, both of these, man, look awesome. And uh, here's the chase in gold, almost like a bronze gold color. Even the rims right here, the TVs, same color right there, gold. Fantastic one. Yeah, for the chase, the green one, still the same. And uh, some more updates from M2 Machines. For this set, we got a lot of beautiful cards. Let's take a look at each one of them. First up, we got the 69 Pontiac GTO Judge. The Judge right here. Look at that. Looks awesome in like a uh, maroon red color. Looks really good. Love the chrome wheels on this. Next up, we got the orange 74 Torino Cobra opening hood for all of these cars man the details on uh, these cars of mine are fantastic 71 dodge charger super b right here in almost like a gray blue combination the top is black absolutely spectacular love the spy, uh, five spoke wheels also for this plymouth cuda look at this that is really nice looks really mean man yeah the plymouth uh, hemi cuda look at that fantastic cars man even uh, if i have not seen any of these cars in person because we don't have uh these cars in here i'm talking about real life cars but man these are beautiful i admire them a lot so cool 85 chevy camaro irock z in red always looks really really good the front end of the IROC Z always reminds me of the uh, car from Knight Rider. I don't know if you find a little resemblance of that, but to me, it looks a little bit uh, of the car from Knight Rider, the uh, kit. Moving on, 88 Ford Mustang GT. Really familiar colorway for the Mustang GT. I think uh, some of their IROC Zs had this type of like. Uh, colorway going on way back then moving on the chase which will be limited to 750 pieces worldwide an iraq z right here in black with gold trimmings and look at this fantastic interior is all gold for this one man what a fantastic looking chase right here and uh, yeah that will be all for our, our video for today i hope you enjoy this one if you did, again, subscribe, like, and uh, hit that bell icon so you don't miss our daily uploads. Tons of beautiful cars, man. Really excited about the upcoming Super Treasure Hunt from Hot Wheels, the Honda EK9. My guess that would probably cost uh, over more than, let me see, man, let me see. Uh, probably close to $100, maybe. <laughs> on the resale market once it goes out yep super inflated price but with the ek9 hype with the jdm hype and uh on how good the car looks can estimate close to 80 or 100 us dollars for that 80 to 100 us dollars yeah so what's your guess leave a comment down below and uh, yeah, again that will be all see you on our next episode bye bye guys thank you so much for watching again 
see you on our next video bye bye